Welcome to our YouTube channel A to Z Summary. Here is a detailed analysis and summary of the poem in a station of the Metro by Ezra Pound. Before proceeding further to the summary, I request you to please subscribe our channel and like this video. We have a huge collection of books and novels. The themes of the poem are Ezra Pound's poem in a station of the Metro is a short but powerful imagist poem that captures the fleeting beauty of human life. The poem is set in a metro station, and the speaker compares the faces of the people passing by to petals on a wet, black bow. This image is both striking and beautiful. It conveys the speaker's sense of awe and wonder at the diversity and beauty of human life. The petals of a flower are delicate and ephemeral, just like human life. They are also a symbol of beauty and new beginnings. The poem's second line is even shorter, but it is still packed with meaning. The speaker's comparison of the faces to petals on a wet, black bow suggests that human life is both precious and fragile. Just like petals, human life can be easily damaged or destroyed. The poem's brevity and simplicity add to its power. Pound is able to convey a great deal of meaning in just a few words. The poem is also notable for its lack of punctuation. This contributes to its sense of immediacy and impact. The poem can be interpreted on many different levels. On one level, it is simply a celebration of the beauty of human life. But on a deeper level, the poem can also be seen as a meditation on the transience of life and the importance of cherishing each moment. The poem is also a reminder of our shared humanity. The speaker is able to see the beauty in the faces of the people in the metro station, even though he does not know them. This suggests that there is a deep connection between humans, even if we are often strangers to each other. Thank you for watching the summary. I hope you liked it. Please subscribe to our channel for regular summaries. We also have a collection of 1,000 plus summaries of books, novels, and poems at our website at a Thank you and take care.